This video will teach you how to insert a subcutaneous butterfly. Subcutaneous access is utilized to administer medication via injection or continuous small volume infusion into the subcutaneous tissue, where medication is absorbed through both adipose and connective tissue. Upon a physician's or authorized prescriber's order, a nurse may initiate and manage subcutaneous infusions. Pre-procedure preparation. Place patient in comfortable position. Perform hand hygiene as per hand hygiene policy. Assemble equipment. 2% chlorhexidine in alcohol swab. Tape. Gloves. Subcutaneous access device, 24 gauge catheter. Transparent dressing. Device placement. Don your gloves. Do not prime subcutaneous access device. Disinfect insertion site for 30 seconds with chlorhexidine and alcohol wipes. Work to anticipated dressing margin. Allow solution to air dry. Do not blow or blot dry. Lift skin up into small mound between thumb and index finger. Grab subcutaneous device and insert at a 30 to 45 degree angle into prepared site. Apply transparent dressing. Grasp the white end and gently pull out the guide wire. Clamp and remove the cap. Attach a pres positive pressure cap. Do not flush or prime the line. Check for blood return. Aspirate with a syringe. There should be no blood return, although an air bubble may be seen. If blood return is observed, remove infusion set, prepare new site and use new sterile infusion set. Label dressing with infusion set gauge date and initials of inserter. Therapy initiation. For medication delivery, validate order. You will require an alcohol swab and a syringe loaded with the prepared med. Disinfect valve using an alcohol wipe for 30 seconds and allow to dry. That's a lot of Slowly infuse medication. Do not flush infusion set post medication. Monitor patient's response and infusion site hourly. Rotate access site every three days and recite earlier if bruising, erythema, or other signs of local irritation or infection appear, or if the site is painful to the patient. Select a new site at least two inches from previous sites to facilitate fluid absorption and decrease evidence of adverse effects.